Yes, all eyes on SEBI board meeting which is going to be held later today and uh, it will be important to watch whether or not the board discusses the allegations which has been leveled against SEBI chairperson by Hindenburg research in the month of August. Uh, uh, remember there has been lot of comments which has come in after these allegations have been leveled and uh, as far as the formal agenda is concerned we have been told through sources that it is not part of the formal agenda. However, the board may take cognizance of the allegations of the events that has uh, turned up after uh, uh, these allegations have been leveled against SEBI chairperson. Apart from that, we also understand that SEBI may consider mutual fund light regulations uh, which has been pending for some time. Remember, SEBI has been trying to bring uh, uh, the lighter form of regulations for uh, passive funds uh, who are uh, uh, managing indices. So, so the uh, so the amount of regulations will be less uh, for them and once it is passed it will be easier for many of the fund houses uh, to go ahead uh, with the approval on passive funds. Apart from that uh, SEBI may also discuss new asset class uh, within mutual funds to deter investors from swaying away towards uh, unregistered kind of portfolio managers uh, who were uh, uh, giving unsolicited calls. Now SEBI wants these uh, retail investors uh, or institutional investors uh, to come back to mutual fund and create a new asset class for them. So that might also be discussed and we also understand that uh, uh, SEBI may discuss uh, FNO norms. However, that is uh, not part of official agenda as per sources. It will be interesting to see whether or not after consultation paper which was released by SEBI, uh, it also passes the final version of FNO norms.